watchOS 10 is here and it has some interesting new features and changes but in this video I'm going to be showing you some of the cool new watch faces that this update has to offer. A pretty cool thing I would like to highlight with this new update watchOS 10 you can see here on the left hand side this is watchOS 9 previously on the app selector screen here you had like unlimited play you could zoom out as much as you want and then you could you know select the side or this application that you want but with watchOS 10 as you can see here you know you have limited range it's more as if there's a least view but it's not the three by three that we hoped to see you can see here on watchOS 10 you can't really go side to side like you can do with watchOS 9 and when you go to your watch face here on watchOS 9 you could use your digital crown to see different animations but here on watchOS 10 you can see here this digital crown activates the smart stack feature so it's another change but let's look at some of the new watch faces that are here with watchOS 10 and see if there's a change in the watch face selector so we'll go to our new watch face selector and automatically you can see there is a little bit of an update previously on watch os 9 you can see we had a cancel but on watch os 10 this has been made to an x and it's no longer text but other than that scrolling down when you're when you're looking at your watch screen it's pretty much the same and the ui here is more or less the same besides the x and you can see here on watch os 10 we have two new watch faces that we are going to be looking at that is the palette and the snoopy watch face so i have selected the palette watch face here and this is it that you are seeing here in motion and if we go to the iphone and see what apple said about this watch face you can see it says that palette uses dynamic color to highlight different elements of the watch face and gradient follows the hands and change as the second hand sweeps around the face. You can choose from a variety of color combinations and select up to four complications. So that is what it says about this new palette watch face. And you can see here, you know, to edit is pretty much the same here. If we click edit right there, you can see we can choose a variety of color combinations and it's up to a maximum of four. So this is what you are seeing here. You can see we have white, purple. I think the default color is pretty much the best when it comes to this. And then when you go to complications, you can see we can choose up to four complications and then when you click on a complication you can see this has been updated with watch os 10 previously on watch os 9 if you were to choose like a watch face and then edit and go to the style here or the complications this is what it shows you but here you can see it shows you featured complications this is something that's new and it's an update and you can see for example some of the featured layout or ui but then it shows you all the applications here now if we're to do the same on watch os 9 you get to see a list but this ui and background has been updated slightly on watch os 10 so that is the complications that come with this watch face and it's pretty much just using different colors to depict the seconds the hour and minute and then there's a fourth color for the background and this is how it looks on the Apple Watch Ultra. Now, the second watch face that comes on watchOS 10 is this Snoopy watch face. Now, this one is a funny watch face because every time it does a different movement or a different play, if I was to lower my watch like this and then raise it up, you can see Snoopy does something different. Like right now, he's laughing at something and then he, he got grumpy if I if I lay my wrist down and then raise it up again you can see he does now more action and he seems like he's doing some work and I counted the complications but every time there's new ones that pop up and by the time I stopped counting there were about 25 different complications that Snoopy does that I had recognized so it's pretty good and he's able to interact with the hour or minute hand and that is what actually Apple tells us because if we go on the iPhone here and look at the Snoopy watch face Snoopy interacts with both Woodstock and the hands of the watch to bring information to life depending on the weather time of day and day of year and more on Sunday, the color of the background changes to the hour, paying more homage to Sunday comic strips. The face is available in three different styles, each using lettering from Peanuts Comics. So 
that's the explanation usually with this snoopy watch face if you wake up in the morning snoopy might um start to show an animation where he's brushing his teeth or at other times if you if it's raining outside then snoopy will show or will stand in the middle of the rain and then he'll be able to do different complications if the weather is sunny you'll see him with sunglasses standing in the sun and yeah it's a pretty overall fun and good watch face that's here and you can see this watch face you can explore once you update to watch OS 10 now i have here the the watch OS 9 update here and you can see i have the astronomy watch face so if i was to go here and select the astronomy watch face and by the way another thing that they changed on watch OS 10 before we used to be able to scroll like this to be able to change our watch face you can see on watch OS 9 here you can do that and it's pretty easy right but here on watch OS 10 that is no longer the case but also because they have the new smart stack you can't use your digital crown like previously on watch os 9 to be able to activate different animations with this astronomy watch face if it's the one that you have on watch os 10 you have to tap on it and then once you tap on it you can move your digital crown like this and then that way that is how you're going to be able to see the different um astronomy features around the world so those are some of the changes that are here with watch os 10 when it comes to watch faces and being able to change your watch face i'll be covering watch os 10 in more detail so if that's something that you are interested in definitely do subscribe and i will help you out with the information so that's about it for me stay safe and i'll see you in the next video